What's up, what's up, what's up? It's your man, Chaz Ellis, once again, giving you the information that you asked me, answering some of these questions. Um, <clears throat> I got a question just now about how do you get a guy to take you out instead of staying at home all the time? A new phenomenon that's going on over the last, it might be even 10 years, is that dudes no longer take women out on dates. Now it's all about, yo, let me come over to your house and watch some movies, shouty. Let me chill with you for a minute. You know, it's that kind of thing rather than taking girls out. And a lot of women are tired of that and don't really want to deal with that crap no more. Women want to make a, a guy to make some kind of effort, let them know that he's interested and that he's willing to take them somewhere. Okay, so I got three ways that you can go about getting a guy to take you somewhere rather than just leaving, being at the crib and you cooking dinner or whatever. Okay, number one is don't make yourself too available. A lot of women, y'all just too damn available. Bro will call you up like, what's up, girl? I'm about to come over to the crib and chill with you. Blow that back out. What's up? You like, oh, okay, well, all right. I guess I ain't got nothing else to do. So what a guy is, if you're going to be available to me not spending money on you and me not taking you out anywhere and me not having to go through making plans to be with you, then I'm going to do that, you know, because I may not want to do all that crap. So stop making yourself so available when a guy is not taking you anywhere and not doing anything with you. Make sure that you're like, hey, I'm not all, I'm not going to be available. If he calls you up and says, hey, you want to hang out? I'm like, well, what do you want to do? Ask. And if it's not something that you're willing to do or that you want to do or you're interested in, be like, nah. Sorry, I'm not. I, I'm, I'm busy. I'm going to be busy that day. My bad. So just do them like that. Don't make yourself available for all this free stuff or all this stuff at your house. You can hang out with your own, at your own house by yourself. Um, number two, make them earn sex. A lot of women try to give dudes sex on the first time they meet them, the first date or whatever, or within a couple days, and then expect the dude to keep courting them for sex. It's like, I already had sex with you. I'm not going to sit here and spend money to get you somewhere where I can have sex with you when I had sex with you the first date. That doesn't make any sense. So that's a big thing you want to make sure you do, is make a dude earn it. That way you can have a, bear, a stronger leg to stand on when you're trying to get that dude to spend money or to take you somewhere. It's not necessarily about the money. It's that you want him to take you somewhere and spend some time with you. You want him to, to make an effort to make you feel special. And he's not going to do that if you're not making yourself feel special. And if you're not making him feel special by making him feel like he got something that he earned. If you're just letting the brother hit it right off top, he's probably going to keep you know, bringing you to his mama's house and bashing it on the couch. His man ain't gonna take you, man ain't gonna take you to the beach if he can smash on his mama couch. Come on. Okay. Third one. This is the last one. Uh, you gotta come up with some creative things to do yourself and ask him out at times. Because if you're not coming up with anything creative to do, anything fun that you wanna do, it's kinda hard for a dude to really be like, okay, this is what she likes or she wants to go some places. Sometimes you gotta come up with some creative things to do. Even if every once in a while you have to pay for it, that's fine too. But you want to make sure that you're saying, hey, I want to get out of the house sometimes. I want to do some things. Now, if he's always making you pay for it, you might have to check the dude the deuces. But make sure if you want to get out of the house, do what it takes to get out of the house. All right, so be, make sure you should let dude know what's up. Hey, this is what I want to do to get up out of the house. Take me somewhere. All right, hope I was able to answer your question pretty well. It's your man at Chaz Ellis. Once again, uh, hit me up on Facebook at Ask Chaz Ellis. I also got a new blog, um, Ask Chaz Ellis on Blogger. Um, you can also hit me up with questions and stuff like that. Put them in a personal message. Leave comments in the box below. Like and subscribe. Peace.